Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. While Sunday was my day of rest, I think that's what you're supposed to do on Sunday, at least that's what I did yesterday. Today, Monday, I'm going to be running around like a chicken with its head cut off. Mostly sitting with the chicken. I mean, not, I may, may eat chicken. So, uh, I'm driving now to get my morning espresso. Wanted to jolt across town to get a Pete's since we didn't do that this weekend, uh, since I was gone. But uh, I was awakened by the sound of the doorbell. Ding dong. I have a guy who came over to maintain the air conditioner because it needs maintenance. You should get it looked at if you have one. Ah, the joys of home ownership. I've said that before, I'll say it again. Maintenance, 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 maintenance. Plus I have to catch up on all my emails. Now I'm gonna head down and get uh, the business mail and also pick up my personal mail because apparently they uh, ignored the cancellation of mail or the hold mail cancellation and they may be holding on to our mail. I don't know what's going to be in it. It's probably just mostly junk. Why I even bother to check mail anymore is beyond me. Although, I may have a few surprises at the business mailbox. Good surprises. As expected, I have a few packages here. One, two, three, four, five, six. But instead of opening them all right now, today, I think I'm going to try to space them out. So I'm only going to open one today. I don't want to overwhelm anybody out there and let them believe that the only thing I do every day is go down the hill, get some espresso, open a package, go home, eat, talk, and go to bed. But, by the way, that happens to be my routine, happens to be my life. I can't make myself unboring. Sorry. Calm before the storm. Well, I'm down from a thousand messages in my inbox to 161. Bit by bit, one by one. This is work. Green eggs and no ham this time. The green, I would assume, is spinach? Yeah. Looks good. You guys want some? Too bad they can't have any, you know? That's what they want. They want the food that you make. I always want the food that you make. This is the only way I get to eat. <laughs> Otherwise, I'd be just eating beef sticks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Diana and I believe in rough play, and apparently I got a little too rough a few minutes ago. Sorry about that, honey. Okay. I didn't mean to ruin your shirt, but I, I need to clip my nails. Apparently. Just call me Wolverine. These are all stab wounds. Well, the wounds would be on your back. Those are just uh, air holes to help make it aerodynamic. You can run faster. Go run into the other room. No, no, don't run in place. Go run in the other room. See how fast you... Look, that's like at least ten times as fast as you were jaunting before you put that shirt on. It's cute. Do you like it? Yeah. Do you remember I wore it when we were dating in long distance relationship? No. Well, I remember before she was famous. See? Because it says before she was famous. Look, and now you're famous! Look, Britain. Uh huh. Engagement? Yes, oh, engagements. Oh, engagements. You've been engaged before? What's that say? It says chance. That's the chance you took on me. Take a chance, take a chance, take a, take a chance, chance, take a chance, take a chance. I'm so glad you're back. You change your mind. I can leave again. Put your finger in my holes. <laughs> <laughs> that just sounded weird, honey. Does that feel good? Oh, that itches. Uh, uh, oh, by the way. Here, let's turn around this way. Someone was asking about the painting of Wicket and Pixie. This is a, a Natasha Westcoat original. We actually had it for sale at one point. I don't know if she still has it for sale, but proceeds would go to, uh, I think, the Seattle Humane Society for people who purchased it. You can get a print of that original there. She painted it live at live.perlo.com. Someone was asking. Okay, now we can return to the regularly scheduled hug. Okay. Mm. Did you miss me? I missed you.
More than you missed me. I can't breathe. Uh. It's Monday, isn't it? It doesn't feel like a Monday, but you know, I recorded the entire geek out and forgot to flip on the mic. So now I've got to record the entire geek out again! At 5 p.m., I am now fully showered and stink-free. It is time to watch a little entertainment on the television by way of a crude media form. A disc just kind of spins around and a laser hits it. And then pictures and sound show up on the screen. And after that, we got to do something else. This is better than popcorn. Oh, shut up! Not you with it. Diana brought me some snacky snacks. I'll be finished with them in about 10 seconds. Doesn't take much. Oh, at least this stuff. That stuff I love sipping on, like, over a period of time. What are you doing? Which one of these should we open first? One a day. They're all yours, Bean. Yeah, I know, but which one? We'll make this a team effort. This one. All right, this one? Okay. Here. Oh wait, it's from Apple. Oh, it's my Apple Care protection plan. That wasn't very exciting. That's right. it for today. No, 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 no. We get to choose a fun one. Which one? This one. All right. Why'd you have to pick a boring one? <laughs> All right. It's a mini fig from somebody who likes Vikings. We have to return the movies before 9 o'clock. We have 2 hours and 10 minutes to do it. It's kind of close. Yeah. Really close. What? What? There's a ladybug on you. Oh, there is. Whoa. Oh, that's awesome. Wait, I can barely see it now. It's like going against the... Come on. Come on, little ladybug. It's so cute. Should we take the ladybug home? We should let it go. Okay. Fly away into some windshield somewhere. Where is it? Oh, look at that. Hang on. It's like a little beetle bug. Yeah. Yeah, and you know the only reason we think they're cute is because they're decorated that way. If this was like any other kind of bug, like you'd be like screaming your head off. Bye bye cute little guy. You don't know, it could be a girl, it's a ladybug. <laughs> oh, it's true. Bye bye ladybug. You gonna show them what we got? Oh yeah. We got egg whites. Yay! Hey, I got a question. Why do we never buy egg blacks? Does that mean we're racist? You remember when I said you remind me of rice pudding? No. Why do I remind you of rice pudding? Because you're white. Why is rice pudding never black? I'm just asking these questions, hon. I know. I mean, I don't want to be seen as a racist. Why is it never brown? Or a foodist. It, it can't, you've heard of brown rice. Not brown rice pudding. I'm sure it's possible. I don't know what it tastes like. Not to say that... Brown is bad. We've all known that I like brown. Mm -hmm. Chris is stuck. Uh oh. Are you okay? Who has the most awesome wife ever? Chris Perillo, Chris Perillo, whose wife cooks him steak wrapped in bacon. Chris Perillo, steak and bacon. Yum. Steak and bacon? I'm gonna let you cut into it. Well, so you made three? Yeah, you tell me what's from bread. What are you gonna eat? This was perfectly prepared. And these look awesome too. Basil and mozzarella and tomato. These are fresh tomatoes from the garden down in Texas. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. 
I know you can't see me very well, but don't let that stop you from liking this video.